And South Korea's prime minister has laid out more details about the vaccinations that will start in the country on Friday. First will be the jab from AstraZeneca, as announced previously. And Pfizer's vaccine will be rolled out starting the very next day. Lee kyung has more. It's a big week for South Korea as the country will begin its first rounds of COVID-19 vaccinations. The AstraZeneca vaccine will be rolled out starting at 9 a.m. on Friday for staff members and patients under the age of 65 at nursing hospitals and related facilities. From Wednesday to Sunday, SK Bioscience, which manufactures the AZ vaccine in the country, will transport the batches to a storage center in Ichan, Gyeonggi-do province. Those batches will be enough to inoculate some 750,000 people. From there, the vaccines will be distributed to nursing hospitals and public health centers nationwide. Nursing hospitals will carry out inoculations on their own. But public health centers will set up vaccination centers for care homes that do not have the infrastructure to do that. On the same day, some 117,000 doses of the Pfizer vaccine will arrive in the country from the global vaccine supply scheme, COVAX. And they'll be distributed starting on Saturday to inoculate 55,000 frontline medical workers. The first batch will be sent to the vaccination center in Seoul's National Medical Center, then to other state-run medical centers across the country. Doctors and nurses will need to visit those sites to get their shots. COVID hospitals with more than 120 staff needing vaccinations will carry out inoculations on-site to prevent a staff shortage. The Food and Drug Safety Ministry previously granted the Pfizer vaccine emergency import approval. But it will hold its first consultative meeting with an independent advisor panel on Monday. It aims to give it an official approval like AstraZeneca's by the first week of March. Lee Young-un, Arirang News.